Hiya folks, welcome to another video. So, um, I've been playing Roblox for nearly about a month now, maybe less, I don't know, I only started playing it, um, around, I don't know, really recently. And the main game that I play is Adopt Me. And the amount of times I've seen people get scammed is ridiculous. So I'm gonna make this guide on how to not get scammed. The trade license is pretty important for trading rarer items or pets. So anything over the rare rarity, like an ultra rare, legendary, all that. Um, all of that you need a trade license for. That and to trade like a lot of pets and stuff, you also need it. Um, and you need to take a little test to get it. It's completely free to get it. You just need to take a test. And during this test, you will learn, like, it gives you three little things to learn, and two of them, well, not two of them, but all three of them, are, uh, um, basically whether or not something is a scam, and it's really important to go through, because, yeah, um, otherwise you might get scammed. So, yeah. I've seen a lot of things to do with trust trading. Um, do not trust trust traders. Okay, that's all I can say. Because they're just like, hey, you want to do a trust trade? You're just like, sure. And they're like, okay, give me your starfish and I'll come back later on my alt account to give you the payment. Don't trust them. <laughs> Don't trust trust traders. They will take your pet and they will never give it back. You will never see that pet again. So many people have lost their pets to trust trades. Um, it's ridiculous. <laughs> um, it's one of the things that you learn when getting the trade license, and yet people still fall for trust trades. So I figured this would be relevant to bring up because of how often it happens. So yeah. Picador is a game that people like to play on Adopt Me. That they t they basically just spam in chat A B C if if you want to play Picador. Um, don't play Picador, okay? Because um, the people who want you to play the game, uh, as far as I've seen, they ask for money or pets for you to play the game and they don't tell you that you have to pay until you get it to the house so, yeah um people have lost money and pets because of this game especially since it isn't guaranteed what you'll get from Picador you could get absolutely nothing from it just don't play it if you want to keep your money and pets. NFTs have been around for a little while. They're massive scams. Um, basically, you pay cryptocurrency, which destroys the environment, by the way. Cryptocurrency destroys the environment because it takes up too much resources to transfer it. Um, from one person to another and crypto mining doesn't help with the environment either because it does the same thing. Um, basically you pay cryptocurrency for a digital item, typically a piece of art or, an, or a video or basically stuff like that. Um, 
don't do NFTs. Don't use crypto because it it's a scam and it harms the environment. Uh, unfortunately, NFTs have gotten into the Roblox community through people selling pets as NFTs to other people. Please, please don't do this. They aren't worth anything. You can easily get yourself another one from an egg. Please. The, the NFTs that you get normally aren't worth anything already, but the ones you get from Adopt Me are worth even less if you consider the fact that you can just buy an egg. Please. So, that's the end of this. Um, I, I hope you found it at least a little enlightening. Um, people get scammed every single day on Adopt Me. Please don't fall for these stupid scams. They aren't worth it. If you paid real money, don't tempt fate like that. It's it's not worth it. Have a nice day or night wherever you are. Bye bye.